Twitch while you're. You Should we pop out? I no. think. Well, you guys are like not evenly spaced. <laughs> I don't have all. <laughs>Hey there guys, gals, and sorts. Welcome to Cheesy Games, where we are the cheesiest. I'm Ryu Karata. This is going to be video one of my in-depth Torbjorn guide. I'll only cover Torbjorn's main weapons in this video and his abilities in the next one. I'll make an update video once Torbjorn is reworked, but as it looks like right now, that won't be for a while. Joining me today will be Jedi Master Odo, Maddie Lewis, Blueberry, Mighty Jesu, and Elite Ninja 56. They're gonna be my test dummies for the purpose of this video. Well, let's get started. But first, here's the joke of the day. What is a pirate's favorite song? Got it? It's shake, 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 shake your booty, shake your booty. <laughs> well, that's enough of that. Let's begin. Now, I want to first cover that Torbjorn's popularity isn't that great. Most of this is due to the fact that Torbjorn, to most people, believe he's easily countered, can't do that much damage, and very, very dependent on his turret. This is where I disagree. Torbjorn can be very effective if you know how to play him. I tried to look up many guides on how to play Torb, but most of these so-called guides out there are either troll videos or where to place his turret. While I agree that turret placement is important, it is only part of his kit. This is the reason why I created this guide. I wanted to help dispel some of those negative notions that people have with Torbjorn. We'll start off with Torb's gun. Torb's river gun has two modes of fire. His primary fire is a single river shot that does 70 damage, which is the same damage as McCree's primary fire, but with a magazine size of 18 shots. The fire rate is 1.67 shots per second, which is slightly slower than McCree's fire rate at 2 shots per second. The pellet itself travels 55 meters per second, which is slower than Hanzo's arrow, which travels up to 87 meters per second and can be headshot for double the damage. The pellet does lose height as it travels in the air much like Hanzo's arrow, so compensating for it at longer ranges would be harder. This is considered a projectile so it does not have any falloff damage unlike McCree's primary fire, which has an effective range of 20 meters before damage falloff. Turbine's alternate fire is spread shot of 10 pellets that do 15 damage each for a total of 150 damage, which is the same as Roadhog's scrap gun. The pellets consume 3 shots of the 18 round magazine for a total of 6 shots. The fire rate is of 1.25 shots per second, which is slightly slower than Roadhog's fire rate at 1.3 shots per second. The pellets travel about 80 meters per second, which is faster than Roadhog's 57 meters per second. Bone only has an effective range of 7 meters before suffering damage fall. The alternate fire can be headshot for double the damage. Torbjorn has one of the longest reload times at 2 seconds, so it is important that he uses his gun effectively. Torbjorn should be played at medium to short range to be effective and only be at his turret when he builds or is there is a downtime to repair. No, do not babysit the turret. One way I found to maximize Torbjorn's gun to output the most damage in the shortest amount of time is that you should alternate his fire modes at close ranges. If you start off with his primary fire and alternate between the two, you can effectively output 1100 damage before reloading compared to only using his secondary which has an output of 900 before reloading. This will easily allow you to take out multiple people during a single fight. This will become especially effective when Torbjorn uses his ultimate which doubles his attack speed. Only two characters in the game currently have two weapons, one being Torbjorn and the other Mercy. Torbjorn's secondary weapon is his forge hammer, which is mainly used to upgrade and repair his turret, but it can also be used as a weapon. The hammer itself repairs Torb's turret for 50 per swing and deals a melee attack of 55 damage to an enemy per swing. Upon testing, the range of Torb's hammer is slightly shorter than his melee attack, which I believe is a mistake because usually weapons give the user a longer reach. This might be due to his melee being his claw, but I would think at least it should be the same range if this were true. There are two reasons you should switch to his hammer to attack this enemy. The first is when you face tanks such as Reinhardt or D.Va that can easily block your rivet gunfire and carry their shield with them. Since barriers and defense matrix cannot block melee attacks such as Reinhardt's hammer or Genji's blade, use Torb's hammer against it 
it is the best way to continue to do damage, especially when trying to finish off the tank. If they do end up dropping the barrier, you can back up slightly and switch to your gun to keep unloading on them. This brings up the other reason to use his hammer. When Torbjorn uses his gun and then switches to his hammer, your gun animal will automatically refill after 2 seconds, and then you swap back to a full mag. If you time this correctly, you'll never have to reload and stop attacking with Torbjorn. Well, this concludes this video. If you liked what you saw, please like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell icon to get notified of our videos we upload and stay up to date on the content we produce. Thanks again for Jedi Master Odo, Maddie Lewis, Blueberry, Mighty Jesu, and Elite Ninja 56 for joining me to help create this video. You can check out their channel on YouTube. I will link their channel in the description. This has been Ryu Karada. Keep it fresh and remember to never cut the cheese. Move. Thank you. I look right. legendary, man. Look at that. Okay. Sure. <laughs> right. Looks like I came out of a loot box. So I need like one. Let's do this. I don't know what you guys are doing anymore. <laughs> Me neither. This is just uh, each of you stand next to a turret. <laughs> All right. Okay. This is perfect. And now they're even spaced. That everybody stand next to a turret. Oh, stand. We'll, we'll we'll alt on three, okay, and then just stand there. All right, Should one. we have our hammers out? Yeah, I'm a Shit. Did it not record? I don't understand.